happening. So recently, Turkey Killer sent shockwaves to the nation with his extraordinary birthday outfit and shoot. So today, we have the pleasure of having him here in studio, and we're going to find out more about him. Join us as we welcome Jamal Butler, better known as Turkey Killer. Welcome, Jamal. Welcome. Hi. <laughs> So your birthday outfits, I've been following you for some time. Your birthday outfits are always over the top, extraordinary. How do you come up with these designs? I imagine the things of designing how I want the suit to do. And once I get that in my imagination, I will look for the material that will shine. And once I get the material straight to my tailor and give my tailor all the information on a piece of paper for him to follow the instruction. We never do it alone without my instruction. Oh, wow. So you're the designer. Yes. <laughs> well, you were t- talking about looking for material that shines. This definitely shines today. That purple shines. So is purple your favorite color or new no. favorite? All colors is my favorite. Awesome. All colors cool. are your favorite. Yeah. Yes, because so I've pictures. seen you in yeah, different yeah. ones. I've seen you in like red. I think I've seen you in gold. But is sequins, like do you like sparkly stuff? Is sequins your favorite fabric? Yes, sequins is my favorite because... I does not just use them for celebration, not just for competitions. I use them when I'm traveling. So if I'm, not, I'm going to a place where I'm going to meet my brothers, I will go in one of these to let him know. You cannot miss me, brother. I can do it in something <laughs> that's shiny. <laughs> Definitely. As a matter of fact, I think that's a great, it's great for, like I was running this morning, if I had reflective material like that, Seriously, nobody, nobody, nobody will miss you, so maybe that's something that you can think about. So, did you expect such a reaction to your birthday photo shoot? Because you got a reaction, you know, you know that. Yes, I expect that because I always do it on my own. So it's an every year thing? Yes, it's nothing to be scared of. <laughs> As we can see. <laughs> right. So, I mean, so do you do this every year for your birthday? Yes. Is it something that you look forward to? Yes, because some of us does not take on our birthday. We just think about just seeing the day that we're born and does not come up with an idea of celebration. Mm -hmm. So this is your idea of celebration? Yes. (laughs) And every time you put that suit on, you feel like it's a party, right? Yes. Even though it may not be a party event, Mm -hmm. I feel like I'm partying with myself. Right, that's, that's, that's a good one, that's a good one. <laughs> so, I mean, you had all of these photos. Can you tell us who is your photographer and who edits your pictures? My mom is my photographer and I'm the editor. Wow. You guys... talking about a whole new fact here. <laughs> yes. So my mom will take my phone, take my pictures, and I will just go into my phone and edit. Mm, wonderful. So tell us about the editing process. Does it take a long time? Again, you had so many pictures. I went on your Facebook and I felt like I was scrolling for days. Does it take a really long time? No, it doesn't take a long time. It could have done in an hour. Well, that means that you could take a lot of pictures. Yes. Awesome. <laughs> What's, sorry, what, what, what do your fans tell you? You know, you're, you're big on social. What do they tell you? What are the comments? He's big in real life. Well, they're telling me to keep shining, don't give up. And some are just... So shocked that like I reach from one island to the next. They didn't expect me to travel in the digital form. But I let them know, since we cannot travel right now, I'm traveling in the digital form from one place to the next. Wow, I did see some pictures of you in different locations. I hope that we're able to see um, some of these. Um, so... You're very popular online, but can you tell us how you became popular? I think you did some calypso, you did some singing. Can you tell us about that? And have you retired or are you still singing? I get popular because of my music. Mm -hmm. It brought so many people home. And making myself on social media, it has been like a highlight to the world and our outside neighbors and our home neighbors. I always share them that. When you don't have no one to speak to in your own community, speak to the online neighbors. Sometimes they encourage you according to the conversation you keep up with them. How do you select your backgrounds? Because your backgrounds are very interesting, you know. I just think of the background that I will like. And you know, they always say, download what you think of and just find yourself to edit, make yourself look like you are there, even though you are not there. 
<laughs> yeah, okay. Looking at this outfit right now, I don't know if you guys at home can see the whole thing, but I'm telling you, he's covered in purple from, from head, head to toe. To toe. Sparkly oh. purple. Literally head. Sparkly purple from head to toe. You got some tailor. <laughs> well, the tailor will do the stitching, but I will do the design of the shoes, the belt, the hat, and the gloves. So you okay, have gloves as well. Yes, the gloves are light. <laughs> <laughs> while I talk about your shoes because I really thought that for a second the tailor did the outfit and you just stepped into it from the bottom. Now you're telling me that there's shoes that are separate. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> and you designed them. Yes. I sewed the glove with my own hand. Oh, you so you did the gloves with your own hand? Yes, I did not use a machine. I just use my hand and I do the gloves. Wow, this is, I mean, are you inspired for your about the, the outfit, Jamie? I'm having a Johnny Cochran moment right now, but anyway. <laughs> <laughs> so what, does this, what is this supposed to be? Well, the belt is a title of celebration. Oh, wow. And because it does not have one person to celebrate with, I have many people who is on the same day, in the same month, I always say, if I'm going to make a belt, I cannot make one. Oh. I have to make two because... Once I have my celebrate partner with me, I cannot left him or she out. Oh. I have to give them a title to hold when it comes to the photos. All right, right. And I saw a picture with you with Dr. Denzel Douglas. He's also born on that same day as you. And I saw him wearing your belt, so now I see where it comes in. I mean, I think we're going to take a short commercial break, and we'll be right back with more Turkey Killer. I mean, who is an um, entertainer, fashion designer, extraordinaire. We'll be right back. All right, welcome back. We have been talking with, and I get to say, I get to say we've been talking with the Cherokee killer, and we will be looking some more at what makes him so popular. So, Cherokee killer, you are also a Calixonian. Uh, your most recent performance was in Sugar Mass 49. All right? So, what's with your song, Get Real, as well? We have a clip. Let's take a look at it. And natural beauty, and that did not make you ugly. Can you confuse like fake news? You got issues with reality. You got fake girl, you fake girl, you fake the real. But you're looking a real man like me. All right, so we're back with the turkey killer. Get real. Talk to me about that performance. Well, that performance is trying to tell the people. Be real with your natural beauty. But if you already have a black natural beauty color, no need to change your color that God gave you. Be real with your color. Make yourself look good. Because when you try to change your color, you like you're just trying to tell yourself, I don't want the color that God gave me. But it's good to be real with your own self. So it's about enhancing your natural beauty. Yes. <laughs> okay, so, I mean... So you've become popular, very, very popular online. Can you give us tips on how we, we can also become popular as popular? Well, maybe not as popular as you, but close to as popular. Well, to make yourself popular, be a self-loving person mm. and make yourself feel good. Don't be scared of the eyes that look at you. The more they look at you, the more you shine. Like That's that. a good one. I want to remember that because of the outfit, by the way, but that's really, really good advice. All right, so... What would you like to say to your fans? I would like to say hi to my fans. I know you all cannot miss me. I know you all maybe miss for performing for Calypso, but I hung up my Calypso belt because of the situation we've been fighting. And I just want to be real with what God gave me. He gave me a body and I cannot break it. I have to keep it. And I have to say hi to my brother in California, my brother in BVI, my sister in St. John's. My sister in the United States and my sister in St. Kitts and Nevis. You can't miss me, always find me on social media if you can't reach me on my cell phone. <laughs> Wonderful. So you mentioned chocolate shot. I mean, just now that you hung up your calypso your calypso hat, why? Because of the situation we're going through, you gotta be inject and no one knows when your transmission body can break. Oh, I understand. Okay, we get it. We get it. We get it. Any plans to go back, bro? To resume? 
What are you thinking about going back to the Calypso right now? I was thinking to change the musical style and just to show the fans. I am a versatile person into music. Even though I'm not singing right now, I'm a trumpeter. I play trumpet. Oh, wow. So do you plan to pursue a career in playing the trumpet? Well, when the time is right, I may do it one of these days. It may not be now, but... One of these days I may be live on social media, playing for the fans to let them know what skill I have into the music. It's not just the singing, but everyone are musician who love to sing, they are musician because they know the beat that they want, but who say you can step up and become the musician of being an instrument player. Mm. I like that. I like that you keep your fans guessing, though. You haven't revealed too much. So there'll always be something to go back to your page to see. Maybe that's another secret in being popular with you. <laughs> Probably. So what else can we expect from you? So your birthday is gone. There's so many more days in the year, birthdays in January. What can your fans look forward to? Well, they can look forward to maybe like a Valentine for the shoot. Oh. They may look forward to an Easter for the shoot. They may look forward to a music festival for the shoot. Wonderful. And I have to say this one, you know, when we get to Thanksgiving, I, yeah, that photo shoot as well. I'll be there. <laughs> <laughs> well, thank you so much, Jamal. It's been a pleasure being in the presence of royalty. You're definitely shining. And we'll take some of those tips that you gave us today. Thank you so much for joining thank us you. on Good Morning SKN. Well, always living to be yourself. <laughs>